Hello my friends, William Poloniak here again at Whole Health Foundation. In this video I'm going to show you two things you can do to increase the pressure on your hydraulic press, especially on older juicers. In time, the pulley gets smooth and may become slippery causing the drive belt to slip. Now there are two things you want to do. One is get a small piece of 100 grit sandpaper and while the motor's turning very very carefully slip the sandpaper in clean the bottom pulley and then secondly we'll take the belt off and we'll clean the top pulley so let's turn it on I'll demonstrate what I'm talking about so very very carefully you definitely do not want to get your fingers caught in there and next, we'll take off the belt, turn it on, clean the upper pulley very, very carefully. Now, what we want to do is create a little bit of abrasion in both pulleys so that it's not smooth. And then replace your pulleys and that should give you a little more traction on both pulleys. And there is another method that I'm going to show you in another video on how you can increase the pressure. But for now, this would be your first step. Also, you may want to replace the drive belt, which may be stretched. So those two pulleys, clean them, replace the drive belt. That may improve the pressure on your hydraulic press. I hope you like what you've seen. And if you do, as usual, tell a friend. And if you'd like to contact me, my phone number is 760-753-0321. My email address is developtrust at cox.net. And if you want to buy supplies or even a juicer, go to my website, wholehealthbound.com. So, 100 grit sandpaper with the motor turning, clean the bottom drive belt. Take the belt off, clean the motor, pulley, replace the belt, and that may do it. I'll see you in the next video.